Hello and welcome to another video. Today we want to have a look at the English vowel sounds and in this video I will teach you how to pronounce the sounds properly and hopefully you will also learn to recognize the phonetic symbol for each of the vowel sounds. In English we have short and long vowel sounds. The long vowel sounds have um, a dot a colon followed after the symbol. This is how you can recognize them. So for example, we have I, short, and E, long. In this case, the sound is exactly the same, only that it's short, I, and long, E. Okay, let's practice the sounds. I, I, E, E, O, O, U, U, O, O. O, O, A, 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 E, 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 Ö, Ö. The last sound is a special sound because it's the most common sound in the English language, in the spoken English language. So it's got a special name, it's called schwa. And the sound is ö, ö, like in teacher, observer waiter, about, computer, teacher, observer, about, waiter, computer. Very good. And have a look at the symbol. Remember what it looks like. This one comes up very often in spoken English. Now we're going to practice the sounds again within words. Here we go. E Seat Green Tree I Sit Grin Fish O, oh. good, foot, pull, o, food, rule, shoe, o, oh. hot, stop, shop, want, o, oh. Walk, door, fall, a, uh, cup, love, money, ah, uh, heart, dark, fast, e, eh, head. Egg said eh head 
lamb, apple, ö, girl, nurse, earth. You've probably noticed by now that some of the words in English sound very similar to each other. In fact, sometimes the only difference is one single sound. And it could be a long and a short sound. For example, e and i. Like in sheep and ship. The only difference in those two words is the sound e and i. All the other sounds are the same. So, then it's obviously very important to get the words right because the meaning is very different. Sheep is an animal, but ship is like a large boat. So, I will give you some examples of words that um, differ in e and e first. Sleep, slip, sleep. Slip, beat, bit, beat, bit, heat, hit, heat, hit, leaving, living, leaving, living, and sheep. Ship, sheep, ship. Now, don't get confused because obviously the spelling of the two words is always very different. But we are talking about sounds, what you can hear. And there the difference is very small. It's only this one single sound that is different. But remember, the meaning can be very different indeed. And you don't want to be misunderstood when you speak English. Next, we want to have a look at the two sounds, U and O. And words that have both the sounds and differ only in those two sounds. Pool, pull. Fool, full. Look, look. Once more. Pool, pull. Fool, full. Look, look. Remember to look up the meaning of the words if you don't know them. It's really important to know the difference in meaning and the difference in pronunciation and sound. After all, you don't want to say after dinner, Oh, I'm full. No, I'm full. Next up, we have a and a. Cart, cut. Cart, cut. Part, put. Part, put. Starter, stutter. Starter, stutter. Very good. And the last pair that I want to introduce today is O and O. Caught, cot. Short, shot. Poured, pod. Once more. Caught, cot. Short, shot. Pod, pod. Very good. I hope this has helped you to pronounce the vowels of the English language better. Remember, these vowel sounds are single sounds. We call them monophthongs. 
We also have the diphthongs. They are put together by two vowel sounds and you can learn about them in my other video. All right, until the next video, goodbye.